Alright, um, welcome to the next step in my Rubik's tutorial, and um, you might notice that the cube looks different as it did in the previous two, um, at the end of the last video, and that's because I was recording this part, and the way I said things was pretty confusing. So I just started, decided to start over and reword things, but um, uh, when I was reversing the algorithms, I messed up somewhere, and I had to start over. It's no big deal, though. So, um, in this step, we're going to be completing this yellow face right here. And, um, yeah, there um, are, so the first part um, is to get a yellow cross, um, just like we did on the white face. And how we're going to do that is um, with one algorithm. It's pretty short. Um, and you're going to... Um, on your top face, you'll either, you'll have three cases. One of three cases. One of them, um, like the one I have, is where you have two edge pieces um, on the top that are yellow, and they form kind of a backwards L. Um, another case you might have is where you have two edge pieces um, that form a horizontal line. In other words, this piece would be yellow, and I'd have a horizontal line here. Or you may have it so... Um, you have none of those patterns, and you just have one centerpiece that's yellow. And, um, yeah. So, first look and decide what case you have. If you have it, um, like I do with an L shape like this, you want to hold it, um, so it looks exactly like this, where it forms exactly what it's supposed to look like, a backwards L. Um, if you have a bar, make sure to hold it so it's horizontal um, like so again if we're present pretending that this piece is yellow um, don't hold it like this hold it like this um, and the final case if you have just one center piece it doesn't matter now before we do the algorithm to make the yellow cross um, something very important to remember is don't hold the cube so yellow is facing you okay that's what a lot of people do and um, it's not right, it's going to mess it up. You want to hold it so any color um, except for white, sorry, um, yellow or white is facing you, so any of these colors will do um, just fine. So you want to check one more time to make sure your orientation is correct, and in this case mine is, and you're going to do the algorithm F U R U I R I F I and um yeah you might have completed your cross um if not you'll have um a different case than you had before um so check to see what case you have orient in the correct way and do the algorithm again um and just do that until you get cross like I have here and remember that your corner colors do not matter at all um so next, if you're lucky, um, the yellow face is done, but you're probably not lucky. So, um, if you look at your top face, and you have one corner that's yellow, um, like this, and let's say this corner is like orange or something, um, if you're like that, you're good to go. Um, if not, look around, um, and look for the one that's yellow right here in the left, um, or you might have where two are the same. Um, and this part's really hard to explain, but, um, if you have one that's in the left face like this, um, hold it like this and do the algorithm I'm about to show you. Um, if you have it where two, um, of them are both yellow, that's what we call headlights, because it looks like headlights, um, hold it so the headlights are facing you, um, and then do the algorithm I'm about to show you. So, in this case, I have, um, it's in the left face, so I'm going to do the algorithm, and it's R, U, R, I, U, R, U, U, R, I. And now, um, as you can see, I have, have one corner that's yellow, um, which is what you need. And um, if you're still confused by what I mean about the different cases you can have in this stage, um, I'm going to make a clarification video, um, and I don't know, that should be up in a little bit, 
Um, I only have one cube right now, um, because we're on vacation, and, um, I left my other cubes in my house, so, um, yeah, and so it'll take me a while to get it up, um, and what I just did there is just a little trick, don't do it, don't try to do it, just ignore it, um, and so, after you get one corner piece that's yellow, um, then do the same algorithm again, which is, um, R, U, R, I, U, R, U, U, R, I. And then you're going to have to do it twice, um, and you want to reorient the cube so that that corner is in the bottom left. Um, so, in other words, t turn it 90 degrees. Um, if after the first time you do it, the face is completed, um, that's great. Don't do the algorithm again. So here we go. Um, R, U, R, I, U, R, U, U, R, I. And remember guys, don't hold the cube like this. Hold it so um, one of these four colors is facing you. Um, with of course the right orientation on top. So now, um, if you do that correctly, then you should have a completed yellow face, and um, I congratulate you for getting this far. Um, if you don't, um, feel free to watch it again, and watch this video again, and um, try and figure out what you did wrong. And um, if you're really confused, um, you know, you can post a comment or something, I'll try my best to help you, and um, I'll let you know um, once I get that clarification video up. I will um, post it in the description so you guys can go there if you're still confused on the possible cases um, when completing the space. Alright.